Alright, how's it going YouTube? Uh, it's time for another one of my update videos. Um, I don't even know if you guys have seen this girl before, besides from feeding videos. Um, I don't think I did a video on her last year, but she is a 2006 aneuristic boa. So what that is, is it's basically the opposite of albino. It's uh, the lack of red pigment. So you'll see she kind of looks like a black and white photo or something. There's no red in the tail. Just a lot of ashy browns and blacks, grays. Um, her name is Ashera. And she's getting quite a bit of size to her. Um, like I said, she's a 2006, so she's going on three years old. Um, hoping she'll be ready to breed next year. Uh, I'm going to pair her up with the Motley who is het annery as well. And maybe we'll get some Motley aneuristic boas. So, just give you a close up here. You can see she looks really ashy. There's no reds at all. Um, I, I think she looks really good. There are some lighter annery boas, and, but she's already s starting to come of age. So uh, her color is starting to dull and stuff, but she still looks really good, if you ask me. Um, the aneuristic is also one of the vital ingredients for making snow boas, ghost boas. So there's a lot of potential with this girl. And she's from Henry Purin, who's one of the Canadian breeders out here. And, yeah. I got her when she was uh, already about two years old, so she, she hasn't been in my collection the whole time. But she's quickly growing, and she's up in the snake room with everyone else. And hopefully she'll be breeding by next year. So there you go, there's Ashera, the aneuristic boa. Um, for size, she's probably about four and a half, going on five feet long. Uh, she's got some good width to her, as you can see. Pretty much my whole circumference of my fingers here. So, there you go. Take it easy.